there are a lot of parents out there that do use that child bonus money for things like extra food, extra clothing, a new bed when it, when the kid needs when the kids outgrowing their beds, things like that. I mean, it, as long as long as the money's going toward the child the child itself, I've never had a problem putting any money in. within a certain time period. It made it hard having a kid, considering I couldn't really get to school sometimes. If she was sick, I'd have to take days off. Um, I had to focus more on my financial being more than my education, because I needed money more than I needed, you know, some book smarts. My daughter needs to be taken care of before I can think of having a career. To have a child, it's a blessing. It could also be challenging at times because of development and growth, but you get through it. Uh, the main struggles that I go through is um, not being there enough for him. Like, I feel like I'm not there enough because he spends most of his day at daycare and I'm at work. And then when he comes home, he's either tired or I'm tired. If you were to have a baby right now, will you be able to provide for the baby? It's not just a right now thing. It's a long term thing. You know, I'm trying to say, like, think about, like, do you have money to support? Where are you and the baby going to live? Who's going to help you? Is the father even involved? I would say just live your life. You're not missing anything by having a baby. What are you missing? Who cares if you don't have one? You're not missing anything. There's always later on in life when you could have a baby. You don't need to have one right now. You're young. Live your life. And the fact that you know him before you get to be with him. Like, you have to know his true colors and know everything about him before you decide to have a baby with him. And make sure you know you're working and he's working because why? It's hard and it's not nice being a single mother. That's all I gotta say to them.